Welcome back, Acadiano. It is fairly quiet in the tropics, but we do have one disturbance off the east coast. That's a large area of disorganized showers and thunderstorms. It'll show just little development, but not significant as we head in the upcoming days. So let's head to the green screen and get a bigger overview of the tropical season. Now we are in July, so we are edging closer and closer to the peak season for tropical development. That will be coming up between September 1st and October 1st. I like it in these white boxes. So that's where we'll have 90% of, well, 90% of hurricanes and 95% of major storms occur after August 1st. And of course, the end of hurricane season isn't until the last day of November. So we still have a long way to go. And with Hurricane Barry that we had, uh, We'll see if that sets the tone for the rest of the season. So if you missed it, we already had Alberto, of course, Braille or Barrel, and then we had a short lived, very short lived tropical storm Chris that uh, made landfall in Mexico. The next names up are Debbie, Ernesto, and Francine coming up. But as far as conditions now, very quiet. Temperature is in the 80s, even some 90s across the entire state. We're sitting at 84 right here in Lafayette, 90 degrees in Ville Platte, 85 towards the west in Jennings. So we do have a slight uptick in moisture right here in Louisiana, a little bit more drier air off towards uh, the west and parts of Texas and Arkansas. So we'll see that. Uh slowly moving to our area during the overnight hours. But as far as rain chances, staying pretty low the next several days, up to at least 30% for Thursday, 40% for the rest of this week. This will most likely be during the afternoon where we'll see showers and thunderstorms pop up. Luckily, it won't be anything widespread either. Very typical for this summer pattern the next several days. But as we head into the evening, we'll see rain chances start to decrease here. Very dry for tonight. May have a pop up shower, but unlikely as we won't have that daytime heat into fuel showers and thunderstorms for uh, tomorrow. Now, the morning dry, but rain chances back up mostly during the afternoon and evening hours. Also, temperatures warming up as well. Back into the 90s we go. And for Friday morning, 70s to kick off Friday morning. So similar conditions that we had earlier this morning. We can expect that for Thursday morning, mainly in the 70s. About 78 here in Lafayette, 76 in New Iberia tomorrow at 7 a.m. And as we get into the afternoon hours, back in the 90s we go. Feels like temperatures in the upper 90s. We may have a few areas in the triple digits. And we aren't uh, expecting a heat advisory either as heat index values are pretty low for Thursday. So Friday morning, 70s again. That's very typical for this uh, time of year. And check out those heat index values for tomorrow. Topping out in the upper 90s. May have some triple digits out there. So uh, overall, stay hydrated, especially if you have to be outside a long period of time. So overview for tonight, warm and humid summer night ahead and going into Thursday. Partly cloudy skies across the board with a few isolated showers possible, but still sticking to dry conditions for tonight. Now for tomorrow, Scattered showers and thunderstorms back again during the afternoon, so you might want to go ahead and keep that umbrella nearby, especially at that passing shower, and they definitely do not last long in the summer, but some can carry uh, a lot of rainfall. So temperature is mainly in the 90s coming up, and of course, a perfect time to take a dip in the pool. Temperature is in the low 90s, but still beware if we have that shower thunderstorm in your area. Most likely want to go indoors until that storm passes. So still keeping in low and rain chances for the rest of this week. Highs topping out in the 90s. Hottest part of this 10 day forecast Monday and Tuesday have 94, but that does not take into account the heat index values uh, coming up either. But very typical summer pattern the next 10 days hot and humid, partly cloudy skies with afternoon showers and thunderstorms coming up. We not expecting anything widespread, very spotty in nature with the rain chances here. And of course, overnight temperatures, a little to no changes there. Humid in the upper 70s, even some low 80s. But later in the show, we'll have another snapshot of this 10-day forecast.